welcome to the 2019 Project for Awesome. My name is Rowan, and I'm a bit more of a YouTube watcher than a creator, but I really wanted to bring forward my favorite charity for consideration this P4A. That's Apopo Hero Rats. Apopo is an organization that trains giant African pouch rats to solve some really unique and difficult problems. There are two main branches of Apopo. The first focuses on landmine detection and land reclamation. In areas where landmines have been laid, it's rarely the combatants who place them that suffer the effects. Subsistence farmers and their families often have no option but to use mined land to support themselves, making them the most likely to be injured or killed by mines. Apopo trains rats to sniff out explosives, and they are light enough to walk over the mine sensors without triggering them. One rat and its handlers can safely demine an area the size of a tennis court in about 30 minutes. It would take a conventional demining team over four days to clear the same area. With the help of Apopo, Mozambique was declared mine-free in 2015. They continue to have projects active in Cambodia, Angola, and Zimbabwe. So far, Apopo has removed over 100,000 mines and unexploded ordnance and reclaimed over 6,000 acres of land. The second branch of Apopo focuses on improving tuberculosis diagnosis and treatment. TB is a major public health concern. It has devastating effects on communities also dealing with high rates of HIV infection, with one infection hastening the progression of the other. In most developing countries, diagnosis happens through lab technicians examining samples individually one by one under a microscope, which is laborious and subject to human error. Accuracy rates of this method are only 20 to 60 percent. The TB detection rats only graduate their training when they are able to identify infected samples with 100 percent accuracy. Once trained, they can check 100 samples in under 20 minutes, a task that would take a technician days to complete. Positively identified samples are then verified by a lab technician and Apopo works with local clinics to get treatment implemented more quickly to reduce the spread of infection. Proper treatment delivered correctly also helps slow the development and spread of drug-resistant TB strains. There are currently 57 participating clinics in Tanzania and 20 in Mozambique. They are also in the process of establishing a program in Ethiopia. So far, Apopo rats have screened over 500,000 samples, detected 15,000 cases of TB that might have otherwise gone undiagnosed, and in doing so, prevented potentially 120,000 new infections. There are lots of reasons why I support this charity. First of all, it focuses on training local people to solve local problems. The program managers, trainers, and technicians are local to the areas they're working in, as are the rats themselves. There are local species being used to solve local problems. The best things about using the rats is that they're low tech, low cost, and can do the job better than a person can. Demining is dangerous, and TB diagnosis takes time and experienced lab technicians, which are often in short supply. Both are subject to human error, and these little guys can help get the job done better. Another reason to support them is they're not only working to help people, but the planet as well. In partnership with Sustainable Agriculture Tanzania, Apopo are working to offset their carbon emissions and train farmers in sustainable practices with the goal of eliminating slash and burn agriculture while reforesting areas subject to erosion. And if you need one more reason to support these little heroes, they are incredibly cute. So please give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and let's help Apopo continue training rats to save lives.